Hello, in this video I would like to talk about how to install MetaTrader 4 on a Linux machine. So let's find out how we can do that. This is not Windows, this is Play on Linux. This um, computer is running with MX Linux, so we are going to use a terminal now. This is my terminal window. Basically it's what you would call a DOS box in Windows. I'm using the German version. My distribution is called MX Linux. This one is based on Debian. But what I'm going to show you will also work on Ubuntu and Debian distributions. For other distributions you might need to use some other tools. But the first thing we would do in Ubuntu or Debian would be to type in sudo apt-get update. That will refresh the repositories. As you see I'm using Debian here. Afterwards you could type in sudo apt-get upgrade. That would probably install the newest packages for you. I have done that for another video today so nothing is being installed here. And to install the software you would use sudo apt-get wine. But there are also graphical options. I'm going to use this one. This came with MX Linux. I really like it because it provides a lot of different sources where we can find popular software. So let's type in wine. And we find wine is a Windows emulation software that is able to run software that was coded for Microsoft Windows without Windows being installed. And Play on Linux is a graphical front end. I have already installed both. So now I'm going to start Play on Linux. Here we are and you can see that I have done installations before. This is the German version but basically it's the same in English. We would click on this link that is called install a program. And then the link below, install a program that is not listed. Now you should see the wizard coming up for the manual installation. We click on continue. And I would like to install the software in a new virtual device. So let's pick that and click continue. I will give it the name MT4 test 2. Click on continue. Configure Wine, continue. Let's pick the 64-bit installation, continue. Here is the Wine configuration wizard. Now we should see the settings window. Here it is. This is the Wine configuration. You can pick some devices. But I'm only going to change one thing. I'm going to pick the Windows version, Windows 7. And here is a tab called Libraries. There we can pick the entry for WinHttp. Click on Add, OK. That's it for the configuration. Now let's pick the installation file here. I'm going to use this one. This is for MetaTrader 4. It's the MetaTrader 4 setup exe that you cannot get on MetaTrader4.com anymore. They have exchanged it with MetaTrader 5, but we have the original setup file on our website mql4tutorial.com. Now let's click on open, continue, and we should see MetaTrader 4 installation. This is the real MetaTrader 4 installation. If you don't see MetaTrader 4 inside of the window, you probably have downloaded the MetaTrader 5 version. Now let's continue with this one. And you see that this bar is moving. If it doesn't move, that might be a problem with your network settings. There are some more advanced tutorials out there but in this configuration the installation worked for me every time. Now it's finished. When I click on finish, probably 
Play on Linux will show me that it has been crashed. Yes, it does. But this is no problem. Because if you wait for a few seconds, you will see that MetaTrader is already starting up in the background. Here it is. Probably it will start to make noise right away. Yes, there it is. I'm not going to set up an account here. Now let's remove that audio noise here. And now you could click on View, Languages and pick the language of your choice. Restart the application. You see it's working. And in this little video you have learned how to install MetaTrader 4 on a Linux device and you have done it yourself within a few minutes.